Tailless whip scorpions or ambulipi are sometimes called whip spiders. Ambulipid which means blunt rump, is associated with them having no tail. Tailless whip scorpions are unique as they have six walking legs, whereas other scorpions have eight legs. The reason for this is that ambulipids' first ancestral walking legs have been tailored into sensory organs. These long sensory feelers could be twice in length of the body and are utilized to look for the environment. Because ambulipids are active in situations where there are less light, these tailored legs are extremely important to them for sensing their surroundings. They do not have the ability to produce silk and do not have venom glands. In this video I will share 7 Amazing Fun Facts About Tailless Whip Scorpions Before we begin we published new videos daily. So be sure to subscribe this channel for the great content. Without delay, let's start. Common Name Tailless Whip Scorpions, also known as Whip Spiders and Ambulipids type, Invertebrate Family, Phrynidae. Weight, it is lightweight. These tailless scorpions range through Guatemala, and several parts of Costa Rica. Tailless whip scorpions live under loose tree bark, in cracks and at the base of tree trunks, or tree holes, canes and inside animal burrows. They are very common at night in Costa Rica. Whip spiders, or tailless whip scorpions, grow gigantic for bugs, sometimes in Costa Rica as much as 5 to 6 inches, big enough to scare most people. Tailless whip scorpions diets are insects and worms. Average lifespan, the average lifespan of life is 2 to 3 years. Average lifespan, the average lifespan of life is 2 to 3 years. Breeding-slash-reproduction Tailless whip scorpions' parental care is tremendously fascinating. Males and females engage in a courtship dance that includes lots of touching and brief grabbing. The male courts the female with trembling movements of his extra-long legs, guiding her to a sperm packet he has deposited. She inserts it into her reproductive opening. Six to sixty eggs are kept in a membranous sac underneath her abdomen until they hatch. Young stick to their mother's abdomen for quite a few days after the birth. Please hit like and subscribe our channel for more amazing content in the future.